Hello everyone, today I'm announcing my new big mod for the Warhan 2.4 printer and the mod is to have this heat pad on a hinge and have it raised up by a gas spring kinda like a car hood or a trunk but yeah, hood is a better example because this is for doing maintenance so yeah, as you can see I modeled it up everything in here and right now I'm printing uh, this, the parts necessary for this on my printer. So today I'm going to walk you over what I have planned for the for this mod. And next week you will see this in action. So first of all uh, I want to answer the question that probably already popped in your mind. And that is how far can you open the hood if you will without touching the gantry. And the answer is more than enough. So this is the 2.2's assembly because I don't have the 2.4 CAT files yet. And well right now as you can see even on this 250 size model I opened the bed about 54 degrees here. And well with the 2.4 the yeah, X carriage is shorter. And well, with a 350 printer like mine, the carriage etc. won't uh, won't scale, but the uh, uh, printer will be bigger, obviously. So that should give me even more opening angle. So this is more than enough to work on the electronics, as you can see. Also, the next question that's probably on your mind as well: How am I going to? Uh, access the electronics and modify them. I will answer that with my current model here. So this is how it's going to work right now. This is uh, this front piece is kind of like a test piece that I'm not sure if I'm actually going to go with. But this is a magnetic front, so yeah, I'm not sure if this will look well or not. If not, try to come up with a latch system kinda like the ones in a car but yeah if this works this will be even nicer so the idea is you raise that and as you can see I separated the deck panel into two pieces so it is very easy to just remove them even with the belts in place and as you can see here I mounted the DIN rails the other way around compared to the stock 2.4 so yeah we can just use the regular electronics mounts for the DIN rails here I'm probably going to mount them uh, like this instead of like this in real life but for the model this works and uh, on the back side I should talk about the hinges themselves I bought some hinges from Aliexpress but I didn't really like the feeling of those metal hinges plus it required me to cut the extrusions so yeah that wasn't a great idea obviously I want to make this mode accessible to everyone in case you want to replicate it so that didn't really make any sense so instead I designed these hinges myself now these hinges use uh, 4 of the stock Voron I think it was F 695 or something like that the regular round one not the weirdly shaped one uh, four of those uh, bearings and the uh, five millimeter shaft in there and you just print these out of ABS with uh, stock print settings for the rest of the parts I don't think you will need this spacer but yeah I, I have it here just in case and yeah that's what the mod mostly consists of I don't have any specific uh, plastic parts designed for the gas spring itself because uh, the stock parts that came with mine and the ones I found on the internet were more than good enough you just need a 90 degree metal corner bracket for this side and you can uh, see them on the screen right now I'm putting a picture the way I'm going to mount them I will link a few in the readme.md file on the github page as well so yeah in case uh, you, wa you want to go through a known good one you can use that now I have a 100 newton one and a 350 newton one 
I'm not sure if the hundred will be good enough. I have my doubts about it, so that's why I bought the 350 newton one. So yeah, hundred newton ones are easier to source, but 350 newton ones are available on the internet as well, and they're not much more expensive. They're just harder to find. That's about it. And the one I'm personally using, I found it at a car parts store. So yeah, you may look there or just buy the one I link. And yeah, this is, that's about it for this mod. I also designed a few DIN rail mounts parts for some electronics, namely the Omron SSR, the four channel relay board for the Raspberry Pi and the Max 31A65 amplifier board from Adafruit. I have mounts for those as well. And those ones are available on my GitHub right now and they will be available in the Voron users get up as well once I create the pull request and I want to create a pull request for all four mods so that's why I'm waiting this mod I probably shouldn't say this but this mod is also available on my github at the moment but I don't recommend you uh, try this yet let me try this first just in case there are some things that need to change and once this is tested I will release the video showing this next week it will be the my war on episode 10 video so yeah you will see it in action in that video and once as i said once this is tested i will also create a pull request and i'm sure it will get approved so yeah i'm pretty excited for this because the electronics were a huge pain for me to reach especially if you if you know my setup my printer is normally in a cabinet so it is doubly hard this is really heavy I have to drag this out of the cabinet, remove all the acrylic panels and then turn this around because and then remove the bottom panel and then reach the electronics. Do the opposite of it again just to realize something isn't working. So yeah, this will be a huge time saver for me and I'm sure for many of you as well. So I'm excited for this mode as I said. And yeah, as I said, I expect this to be finalized by next week, so stay tuned for that. And yeah, that's it for this video. I hope you're excited for this. If you are, please give me a like down below. I will link the GitHub that I mentioned in the description as well. But as I said, I don't recommend you try this mod yet until this is finalized, but you can reach the electronic mounts there at least or just take a look at the STLs for this mode if you want to. And yeah, thanks for watching.